Apple have announced that they plan to keep their iPhone production roughly flat in 2022. Analysts see this as a conservative stance in the face of potentially slowing global growth. They plan to make 220 million units, which is down from the 240 million expected. It is also down from the 2021 production levels reported that were at 233 million. However, according to Dan Ives of Wedbush Securities, he still sees Apple having a $200 price target. The current price is around $150. So does this mean that Apple's strong seasonals can lift the stock over the summer months? Over the last 10 years, Apple's only lost value once between June the 1st and September the 1st. The average of gain has been a very impressive 15.85% profit. The maximum gain has been 67 plus percent, and the biggest and only lost during that period was in 2015 with a 17.10% loss. So does it make sense to buy Apple on these strong seasonals despite Apple's very conservative outlook? Major trade risks. Any signs of slowing growth is likely to reduce demand for Apple products and could weigh on growth expectations. Remember, HYCM clients can access the Seasonax product in order to analyze over 25,000 different currency pairs, indices, commodities, as well as individual stocks. So if you contact your account manager, you can get started with a free trial right away. Certain products and services mentioned herein may or may not be available to all clients, depending on which HYCM Capital Markets Group entity their trading account adheres to.